heels on the turn. They had Glug for the early lead. On the outside, coming away well was Raven Ability. Kentucky Bruce is three wide. Third, getting off fourth as they look for a position. That's Tiscadero, and around the turn they go. The early leader, a half length, is Glug on the outside, racing second of the three ace pole. That's Raven Ability coming on third. Kentucky Bruce, he drops in third. Racing in fourth is Tiscadero. They go off the quarter mile pole. 29 and two fifths. On the front stretch, the leader by a length now is Glug. Quickly up on the outside, Kentucky Bruce to challenge second. Moving up to be third to the half mile juncture. Caught looking down along the rail fourth. That's Raven Ability. They move into the half mile. Glug the leader. Racing on the outside, second after a half mile, that's Kentucky Bruce, the half, one, one, and two fifths. It's Glug, three part, off stride there on the backside was Tiscadero. They go to the three quarter mile pole, the leader three parts of a length is Glug. Racing in second position, that's Kentucky Bruce on the outside. Caught looking comes on third, racing in fourth to the three quarters on the rail. That's Raven Ability in fifth as they turn for home now is Corky Starlight three quarters, 130 and four fifths. On the front end with a short lead glug. On the outside closing ground second is Caught Looking, racing between horses third in the lane. On the front end that's Caught Looking on the outside moving up to get the lead. Corky Starlight moves up second. It's caught looking. Corky Starlight racing second. Gun hook, Walter Paisley. Seven Alcazar Lobel will be driven. They're off. That's Prairie Inky for the early lead. Coming away, second MD Caster with Snowberry into the first turn. MD Caster takes the early lead. Prairie Inky racing second. Snowberry is third racing in fourth. Goes Lingen Hook in fifth is Bevo racing sixth to the quarter mile juncture. Didn't he ramble? Then it's powerful force and he's a low bell. The leader is M.D. Caster by two open lengths, racing in second to the three-ace pole. Goes Lingen Hook, racing third, Prairie Inky. And now tucking in third there by the stands was Lingen Hook. On the front end, it's M.D. Caster showing the way by two, racing in second position, Prairie Inky. Bevo up on the outside, third. Lingen Hook is fourth, didn't he ramble into the action, fifth. Rough gated there is ink. Rough gated was Bevo as they go by the half mile. 59 and a fifth. Into the three quarters, MD Caster stays out there by two. Prairie Inky is second in third. Didn't he ramble? Racing in fourth position now. That's Lingen Hook. Final three-eighths of a mile, M.D. Caster pacing powerfully on top by two. Prairie Inky is second, three-quarters, 128 and three. It's M.D. Caster holding firm, two lengths. Prairie Inky out for the drive, second. Lingen Hook is third. M.D. Caster leads, racing in second through the lane on the outside now. Comes powerful force. It's M.D. Caster, the leader. Closing ground is powerful force, but it's M.D. Caster.
the rough. That's Comperi for the early lead. Down along the inside, coming away well was Kaman Jordan with Harvey Homestretch third. Getting off fourth into the turn, Jewel K. Bo Scamp. Racing in fifth, Lassiter Hanover in sixth, Rhinestone Al. Racing in seventh is AKA Red Alert. Racing eighth to the quarter mile mark, Gary Lee. And trailing the field as they enter the stretch the first time. Destructor, they go off the quarter mile pole, 31 and one fifth. On the front end, the leader by a length is Ampere. On the outside, the challenger second as they go to the three-eighths marker. That's AKA Red Alert. It's Lassiter Hanover getting the lead. AKA Red Alert is second. Racing third as they swing round the turn to the half mile on the rail. Comes Ampere in fourth position now to the backside. That's come on, Jordan Harvey Homestretch is fifth, racing in sixth. Jewel K. Boscamp racing seventh to the upper turn. Destructor in eighth position. That's Gary Lee with Rhinestone Al. They go to the three-quarter mile pole, staying out there by two. The leader, Lassiter Hanover on the outside. A.K.A. Red Alert is second, down along the rail third as they turn for home. Comes Ampere with Harvey Homestretch, caught on the outside fourth. They turn for home, the leader by two lengths now is Lassiter Hanover. Racing in second through the lane comes Ampere with Harvey Homestretch on the outside. Also, come on Jordan. Now getting the lead is Ampere racing in second. Lassiter Hanover, it's Ampere. Off. Between horses for the early lead, that's Flying Frankie, Dusky Brett came away well on the outside, moving up third as they look for position into that first turn. Fox Valley Slicker who cuts right in there as they go round the turn on the front end, the leader, Dusky Brett. Racing in second of the quarter mile, Flying Frankie in third position now. That's Fox Valley Slicker Flying Count is fourth. They go off the quarter mile pull. 29 seconds. The leader, Dusky Brett, racing in second of the three eighths marker on the rail. Flying Frankie in third position by the stands the first time. Comes Fox Valley Slicker up on the outside fourth. Titus Colt. They swing into the half mile mark on the front end. The leader by a length and a half as they go to the back stretch is Dusky Brett racing in second after a half and a minute. Goes Flying Frankie Titus Colt out there third racing in fourth to the three quarter mile pole. Fox Valley Slicker chest of drawers moves up fifth moving three wide with the rush to the three quarters goes Shotgun Spur. They go to the turn on the front end, staying out there. Lord Greg on the outside, racing in second round. The turn is shot, gun spur, chest of drawers. Now comes on third, racing in fourth position on the rail. They turn for home on the far outside. Shot, gun spur gets that lead. Chest of drawers comes on now. Now it's chest of drawers on the outside. Shot, gun spur racing second. Moving up to be third through the lane is Prairie Junior on the front end. Chest of drawers down along the rail. Moving through though.
Wheels and the turn. They're off. That's Shannon Intruder with K Sun for the early lead. Out in the middle of the racetrack comes Dynamite Trip with Top Up. Dynamite Trip takes the lead. Top Up Racing second. Moving up third on the far outside into the turn goes Inclination. The leader is Dynamite Trip. Inclination moves up second. Top Up Racing third in fourth position. That's K Sun. They move off the quarter mile juncture, 28 and 3 fifths. And inclination on the outside gets a short lead. Holding the rail, though, is Dynamite Trip. They've gone three eighths of a mile. The leader is Dynamite Trip. Racing in second to the half mile mark on the rail is top up on the outside. Third inclination. K Sun comes on fourth. Moving three wide, fifth, Denali's Charger, also on the move now in the turn, goes I Furioso. Denali's Charger on the outside is up to challenge Dynamite Trip for the lead. I Furioso racing third in fourth to the three quarters, goes top up, K Sun between horses is fifth, far outside, standout bay is sixth. They go to the turn, the leader three parts of a length, Denali's Charger racing along the rail second as they turn for home, comes Dynamite Trip. Now it's Dynamite Trip regaining the lead, Denali's Charger is second, I Furioso out there third, K's Charger racing fourth, they're across the track, Denali's Charger the leader, K Sun on the outside racing second, it's Denali's Charger in front. They're off. Along the inside for the lead is Beep Beep with past the chips coming away well. On the outside driving up to be third tune tapper with Mega Spirit. Around the turn they go Beep Beep the leader Mega Spirit second. Racing third to the quarter mile mark. Goes past the chips on the outside tune tapper fourth. Ivory Gate is 5th, Decipher 6th, B. Russell Sprout 7th, Joshua's Orchid the trailer. They go to the 3 ace marker on the front end, the leader is past the chips up on the outside, the B 2nd now, Toon Tapper racing along the rail, B Beep, Decipher comes on 4th, racing 5th to the half mile mark, B. Russell Sprout and Toon Tapper takes that lead. Racing in second to the back side goes past the chips. The cipher moves up third. Racing in fourth to the three-quarter mile pole is B Beep. On the front end, the leader three parts of a length is Toon Tapper. Racing along the rail past the chips. The cipher comes on third. Racing in fourth as they go to the three-quarter mile mark. B Beep. They go to the turn there, three across, it's past the chips, the leader, Decipher, three wide, second racing along the rail, beep beep, into the action now is Joshua's Orchid, the field's tightly bunched on the front end, past the chips is under urging on the outside, Joshua's Orchid, here comes Ivory Gate, that's Ivory Gate moving up on the outside to challenge Joshua's Orchid for the lead, it's Joshua's Orchid, Ivory Gate on the outside with B Beep, a driving finish, Joshua's Orchid.
her off. Along the inside, that Sammy Blue Chip with Sandy's finale for the early lead, driving up three deep into the turn. SF United, and it's SF United that takes the early lead, racing second. Sammy Blue Chip in third. Sandy's finale racing fourth. Native Don in fifth to the quarter. American Elgin, Charlie R.L. and Lear Hanover. They go off the quarter mile pole, 28 and 4, and now taking the lead. Sammy Blue Chip racing in second. SF United in third position to the 3A Sandy's finale racing fourth. Native Don. American Elgin is fifth on the outside, sixth. That's unfamiliar along the rail. Charlie RL is seventh. In eighth position, Town Jester racing in ninth. Now Lear Hanover, escort best the trailer, the half mile, 59 seconds. It's the Sammy Blue Chip out there a length. Racing in second, SF United on the outside, third to the three-quarter mile pole. Goes American Elgin, unfamiliar moves up, fourth Sandy's finale is fifth. Sammy Blue Chip standing tall, two and a half lengths, SF United second ahead, along the rail third to the three quarters, American Elgin, three quarters, 128 and two fifths, they turn for home, it's Sammy Blue Chip the leader, on the inside racing second through the stretch, SF United moving up third in the lane, Comes American Elgin, it's Sammy Blue Chip holding firm. SF United Racing second, it's Sammy Blue Chip. No winners in the Super Trifecta, the carryover. They're off. Along the inside for the early lead, it's Bruce driving between horses. Hyzor Amos coming away third. Lalo Noru on the outside fourth as they swing around the turn. Goes Fortune leader with the Possum Hollow. They head off the quarter mile mark of battle for position on the front end. Heiser Amos and Neck moving up his Fortune leader racing in third by the quarter mile. It's Bruce, the quarter, 28 seconds. Fortune leader gets that lead. Heiser Amos is second, racing up on the outside, third under pressure. That's Royal Arms coming on to be fourth to the half mile pole. Call 911. They move in for the half mile on the front end. The leader is Fortune leader, racing in second round. The turn on the outside of horses, Royal Arms. It's Fortune Leader and Neck, Royal Arms pressing second, racing third. Heiser Amos in fourth position. That's call 911. Racing in fifth to the three quarter mile pole. Possum Hollow saving ground sixth. It's Bruce racing in seventh to the upper turn. Comes Jackpot Almahurst and trailing the field now, Lalo Noru. In the final three-eighths of a mile, the leader is Fortune Leader. On the outside, the challenger second, Royal Arms. Possum Hollow comes on third. It's Fortune Leader showing the way. Possum Hollow moves up to be second. Racing in third as they move through the stretch. On the outside of horses comes Jackpot Almahurst. On the front end, it's Fortune Leader. Possum Hollow second with Jackpot Almahurst. They're off. 
Along the inside, perfect Mohawk for the early lead. Moving up is Charge Plate on the outside. That's Royal Performer, and Royal Performer gets the lead. Racing in second of the quarter mile juncture now goes 823. They go over to the quarter mile. The leader, Royal Performer, quickly up on the outside. 823 takes the lead. They go off the quarter, 28 and two fifths. The leader is 823 by two lengths. Royal Performer is second by two. Charge Plate is third, racing in fourth after three eighths goes Perfect Mohawk in fifth. That's Classy Fellow racing in sixth along the rail, Raven Ruler. Into the half mile, 823's had the best of it. He still does a length and a half. Racing in second to the backside, Royal Performer in third position now. That's Charge Plate on the outside, fourth. Goes perfect Mohawk into the three quarters. They go 823 leads on the outside. Perfect Mohawk hustles up second. Royal Performer along the inside is third. Racing in fourth to the three quarter mile mark. Goes classy fellow. They move by the three quarters. 823 moving out to a four length advantage. Racing in second, perfect Mohawk, Royal Performer is third. It's 823, the leader by five lengths along the inside. Perfect Mohawk racing second on the outside. Raven Ruler is third. 823 leads, perfect Mohawk racing second. It's 823, Raven Ruler and perfect Mohawk. They're off. Between horses, that's Fox Valley Zeus for the early lead. Coming away now down along the inside, Fox Valley Jock. Racing along the rail, Shamrock Wolf on the outside into the turn. Goes Tommy Mohawk and around the turn they go. Fox Valley Zeus on the outside is challenging Fox Valley Jock for the lead. Moving up to be third to the quarter is Tommy Mohawk, the quarter... 29 seconds, it's Tommy Mohawk on the outside getting the lead. Fox Valley Zeus racing second in third as they go to the three ace marker now. On the rail, that's Fox Valley Jack moving up to B fourth. Comes uh, Pirate HT and around the turn they go. The leader by a length into the half mile mark is Tommy Mohawk racing in second position by... The half mile Fox Valley Zeus on the outside. That's Pirate HT third moving up to B fourth to the three quarters. St. Elmo Eagle down along the inside. Fox Valley Jock is fifth. Firo Bobo is sixth in seventh, but off stride along the rail now was Shamrock Wolf. They go to the three quarters on the front end. The leader a length and a half to the turn is Tommy Mohawk on the inside. Fox Valley Zoo second moving three wide. Third is St. Elmo Eagle. They're in the lane on the front end. Tommy Mohawk's under a heavy drive on the outside. St. Elmo Eagle's coming to him. Closing ground now is Go Sox. That's Go Sox going fastest of all on the outside to get that lead. Go Sox.
that star date for the early lead coming away second between horses Rocky Nukes down along the rail into that first turn goes Crafty Cobbin around the turn Crafty Cobbin neck challenging second Rocky Nukes in third position now star date racing in fourth of Book and Billy Chicago Ed is fifth they go off the quarter mile only 27 and 4. Rocky Nukes leads a length. Crafty Cobb is second by two and a half lengths. In third is Star Date. Racing fourth. Book and Billy in fifth position and on the move. Chicago Ed racing in sixth. That's Alva O. Driving from third there with Star Date. They go over to the half mile pole. Rocky Nuke shows the way a length and a half in second. Crafty Cabba star date comes on sharply third. Racing fourth to the three quarter mile pole. Book and Billy. And now taking that lead is star date. Racing in second. On the outside of horses comes Alva O. Make that Book and Billy moving up second. Into the three quarters on a short lead. Star date Book and Billy gaining ground second. Racing in third round the turn. That's Rocky Nukes. Crafty Cobb of fourth. They're in the lane. Book and Billy on the outside. Still there along the rail is Star date. That's Star date coming on once again. Book and Billy racing second. It's Star Date, the leader, Book and Billy and Uncle Murph. It's Star Date and Uncle Murph.